Today's ASB Good as Gold, we're in Kerry Kerry to surprise Debbie Sutcliffe. She's the driving force behind Foster Hope Northland. It's a charity that gives foster children just a little something to call their own. Debbie um, runs Foster Hope Northland, part of a nationwide charity that provides backpacks for children taken into foster care. And that backpack is the only thing that they call theirs. She's been doing it for over six years. It takes over her house. Debbie takes no financial money out of the charity whatsoever. Debbie loves her horses. I think when times are bad through Foster Hope, hearing not such good stories, I think going out to her horses gives her that little bit of solace. Without Debbie, Foster Hope Northland wouldn't happen. Here we go. Hey Debbie, my name is Lucas de Jong. Your friends have got in touch and told us about the amazing work that you do for the children of Northland. We hear you're a little bit of a horse fan, so ASB would like to give you a absolutely VIP four-day package to Equitana. It's a $4,000 prize with everything that you could ask for. Oh, thank you. No worries. <laughs> I don't know what to say, I'm just a bit, a bit blown away. That's not actually all of the surprise. Oh no. I'm afraid. We've got a little something else, but we do need to go for a little bit of a drive. Oh. All right, Jimmy. We're here at the shop today. ASB wants to give you $5,000 to help foster hope. Oh, gosh. And make your job a little easier oh, so you can spread a bit of kindness to these kids. It's amazing. I can't, I don't know what to say. It's um, amazing. A lot of it's, you know, over time we, we put the backpacks together but we can't always fill them with all the items until we get some more money in or we get the donations in. So to be able to go and spend that kind of money is uh, incredible. It's like there's so many things in life, we can, it's something that I can do. They're just normal everyday things that we should all have. You can't put it into words really, that feeling, can you? It's a feeling of just uh, wonderment and the, that they're getting out of that little backpack. You know, that, that time in their life when they're really struggling, they've got other people out there in the community that are just showing them that we love them. And you just have to see the kids' faces. Who wouldn't want to do something for those little kids?